Welcome to another episode of the Paul My Back Show. It's me, your host, Sebastian West. Follow me on Instagram at underscore Sebastian West. We can check out my all working on the Splendor. I think I might start a, another channel with just me displaying my artwork. All right, if you don't like when I'm kicking, like when I'm spitting, just know we tuned to this. The cloth is different. 1971. I wasn't born yet, but something, um, a movie was created. Um, Steven Spielberg has something to do with it. It's right into the film, The Duel. The antagonist and the protagonist. Protagonist driving 18 wheeler, trying to run a man off the road for no apparent reason. He doesn't talk, you don't see him. The antagonist stops at the bar. He stops at the bar to get a sandwich, a cheese sandwich. It was crazy. He tried cheese sandwich with lettuce, tomatoes on it. It was wild. It was a wild entree, man. I ain't gonna front. It was wild. So he stops to get a sandwich. He's looked at the boots. Like, well, my bad. He fills up at the gas station, right? Fills up at the gas station, gets ran off the road. All head states like, yo, something wrong with your car? You know, so something's up with him. He's like, nah, I'm cool. He's like, you know what, fam? You might just suffer from the whiplash. He <laughs> you might have suffered from the whiplash. I, I'm going to check, you know, your radiator hose. He's like, nah, man, I heard that before. You're trying to scam me. Get up out of here, man. Fill my, fill, fill my whip up and I'm going to buy it. Hits the road again. Like I said, he stops at this, this like, this diner. Gets a cheese sandwich. Looking at everybody's boots because he thinks that somebody is in here. Because he sees the truck outside. So he stops at this diner to peep, you know, see what's you trying to, listen, I need to know what's going on. So you get in a fist of cuffs with somebody in there, smack my man's sandwich, my man gives him two pieces to the, to the sternum, sat him down, put him on his back pockets, and dips. So he's looking out the window to see who has this 18-wheeler. The man he accused of got into like a pickup truck dipped. He looks up again, he hears the diesel you know, cranking up, so he runs out there, gets on his one-two, pit and pat, chase after the truck, can't figure out who this is. From that point, it goes on and on and on until he finally gets some sort of, um, what is it, vengeance? Some, some vengeance. After all the turmoil, my man takes a nap on the side of the road. After all the turmoil, he like sits on a cliff, Waits for homeboy, puts his briefcase. Oh, he had a phone call with his wife. His wife was tight at him because he didn't defend her one time when homeboy tried to grope her. He's not having a good day at all. Ending in a film, he sits on a cliff, waits for homeboy, puts the briefcase, press the gas to get a head-on collision, fall off the cliff. You never see the antagonist face. Not once in this film, which is why I appreciate it. It left something to the imagination. So salute to the, 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 the person in the comments that recommended the duel. This was this was dope. This was nice, man. These are the type of films I enjoy watching. So if anybody in the comments have something along the lines of this, like it didn't have an agenda being pushed, nothing sexually driven, like what? This is this is all that, man. Seriously. If you have a chance, go check out the duel. It's a good movie. I ain't even on Steven Spielberg or this did something like this, man. Alright. Slow one is better than no run. Oh, matter of fact, man, the duel, eight and a half out of ten. Wish the movie was longer, that's it. Eight and a half out of ten, though, it's fire. Slow run is better than no run. Um, if you don't like my reviews, coming some slack. That ain't good enough. Part of my back was meant for you, ain't gonna miss you. Never forget, let all things be done decently and in order. Like, share, subscribe. Oh, yeah, check out um, my Instagram. Salute.